Monopoly was invented just back in 1935. It's now coming up on its 90th anniversary, and you have a chance at what the next edition of the classic board game looks like. Steve Harris explains. How'd you like to buy the Arch for 400 bucks? Of course, you'd have to use Monopoly money. We are so excited to announce that St. Louis is officially going to be the next city to pass go with your own edition of Monopoly. From Mediterranean Avenue to Boardwalk, each square will be replaced with St. Louis businesses, nonprofits, and landmarks. What do you want to see on the Monopoly St. Louis edition? And the public gets to vote on which locations make the board. I don't know about you, but I would love to see the Muni or the fabulous Fox Theater or the Black Rep or the legendary Club Imperial where Tina Turner got her start. Nice city, though. Sir Topham Hatt and I took a stroll around the city to see where we might land. All right, so hang on a second. So evidently this is Sir Topham Hatt, a Thomas the Train character. This is Rich Uncle Pennybags, the Monopoly guy. Sorry. So of course you got your obvious places, like the Arch, Union Station. Now, there's a good chance Bush Stadium will be on there, but you can also pick more personal places. You know, maybe you'd like to vote for your favorite restaurant, immortalized on a Monopoly board. So how do they decide the cost of each property? That's going to be standard, and then we're still going to have the same tokens, so you're still going to have the dog or the thimble, and then the four corners are going to be the same, but everything else is going to be St. Louis-based. All right, so basically I could buy Union Station for $200. But potentially, yeah, and build your houses and hotels on it, too. <laughs> yeah, bankrupt all your friends with Union Station. Oh, I like the sound of that. The game debuts around Halloween. Voting ends April 1st, so if you have ideas, you better get rolling. Steve Harris, First Alert 4. Such a fun idea. If you'd like to place a vote, just go to saint.lewis at toptrumps.com. You have until April 1st. And you know, while I'm watching that story, I'm thinking about all the fun spots that yeah. it would be fun to put yeah. on the board, like Ted Drew's. Like, you put Ted Drew's, like Mom's Deli on there, right? Uh -huh. You took the words right out of my mouth. I was going to say, Ted Drew's has to be on that board. For That'd sure. be a good one. Corey, I think that you left your Monopoly man head in the dressing room. Are you going to put that on for the time? Yeah, wasn't that whole part of this bit? <laughs> Where's the Sorry. Monopoly head? Walk in the shot you know with the big head? That must have been the email I missed today. Oh, I missed no. that one to do that, darn. But it, it would have been good. It would have. It would have been good. A fun way to 